Hi, folks. It just keeps raining. I haven't seen puddles for a couple months and uh, now it's just wet and completely miserable out. These are the two geese, the two new uh, Chinese geese, the ones that she had the injured wing and they were locked up and uh, then they integrated just fine as you see. <sighs> Everything is just so wet. <laughs> Kind of chilly. <laughs> Just about to feed the pigs dinner, but ugh, ugh! Look at that. It's such a mess. Have to go in there and haul the garbage out. <sighs> I bet these pigs wish they hadn't knocked down the house now. Some of them have been sleeping under those spruce trees where it's relatively dry, but still. Still. Don't you wish you still had a nice house? On the plus side, wet like this means that the electric will work extra well. Which is good because the piglets have been going under the fence. Definitely need to fix this fence before winter. Probably just with hog panels. Because they're more rigid. Avaloo, <sighs> come. come here. Pretty much, I just want to distract him. Oh no, <laughs> so that he doesn't chase them, and then when he's not chasing them, let him know that he's being good. And you can tell when he starts to stare that he's thinking about chasing. Hey, so we distract. Hey, you leave it. You leave it. We leave piglets alone, Avalu. Good boy. Well, that's much better. There, so now his attention is on me and not on that piglet. Good boy. That's very good. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I do have enough covered areas for them to sleep in. No. Oh my goodness, you're so, you're so big, honey. Hmm. Well, maybe we're going to have some July babies. But I wonder if her belly is going to touch the ground first. Seems likely. So there are three piglets out here. One, two, three. Hi, little ones. Hi. And, uh, I'm not entirely sure how many there are in there. There's... I am down a piglet. And that could be like a raven could have taken him. He could have gotten out through the fence. Could have, I don't know, there's all sorts of things that could have happened. Um, but there's no remains and I looked around for him and couldn't find him. Oh, these guys are going to want dinner. Maybe I should feed them before I count piglets. 
Ooh, it's slippery in here. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Hi, Hooligan. Whoa. I hate it when I get going between my legs, is okay? I've trained a couple of them off of it. Okay, guys, come on. Come on. I'm walking this way. Yes. Yes, you're very cute. You are. I'm going this way. How many pigs are we? Also, how did you dig up this wood? This wood wasn't even here before. Oh, shoot. One, two, three, four, five. Six, two, four, six. Seven. And then I think the three that were out. Eight, nine, ten. Not sure though. Well, that was kind of useless. <laughs> kind of useless. That's a... That piglet was looking at the base of the boar to see if he could find a nipple. It's not going to work for him. Hi, Pigo Pig. Oh, there's, uh, yes. Ten. Six, one, and three. Hey, little ones. You're pretty cute. You should run around. It's like the only way to get them to do what, uh, what I tell them to do. Stylish mohawk. Oh, and there's some uh, June berries. They're definitely getting very berry like there. Nice. Nice. Okay, pigs, I'm gonna go feed you, but I have to go get the food first. You guys. So I don't edit these or often I don't actually look back at them. Um, this is a hug panel that I was talking about. They're very firm. So they're good for winter when uh, electric doesn't work. Um, oh, that's a nice shot. Look at that. My pigs are in a row. Well, some of them. Anyhow, I don't look back at these, and I'm pretty sure that if I fell, I would feel, like, honor-bound to just kind of share that video anyhow. Oh. So I had apples last year, and these trees, apple trees, usually bear every second year. But I do see that they're forming some apples. So I'm really hoping that I've been feeding, well, feeding is maybe in a strong word. I've been making sure that they get lots of manure. And uh, water. So I'm hoping that they will fruit this year as well. We'll see. We'll see. This is going to be very good for the garden. If it were a little warmer, it would be better for the garden. Ugh. Ugh. Yuck. This big rut is where um, the truck that dropped off that compost uh, backed in here. And it, it had to spin its wheel a whole lot there. So it dug a rut. Lots and lots of greens, turnips in the middle there, mix of lamb's quarters and beets, cabbages back there, everything looking good. Nice and 
dry spot for the feed. Really good to have. Oh, hey. What are you doing here? Let me just look in here. Oh, no. Okay, you are the male Emden, not the female Emden. I'm Missy. You can see that this drips right here. Um, I did not make this lean-to. I mean, I didn't make any of these buildings, either the woodshed or the lean-to, but I did not make this lean-to, and it's kind of sketchy. Uh, by kind of, I mean, like, very sketchy. It's, uh, like, there's a tarp here that's part of the structure. Uh, there's some boards that go across, but they're supported in a weird way. Um, and it's not, um, when you uh, make a roof like this, you're supposed to use, uh, screws that have a rubber gasket, and not all of these screws have a rubber gasket, so then, uh, water just leaks right through those holes, but it also, uh, condenses on the metal. So it's not really a great structure, but it was here. And once it gets below zero, it doesn't leak because all the water is frozen. I am meaning to tear it down and replace it, but I did um, stuff the walls with straw. Um, so it's quite insulated and it faces south. So it is a good winter structure in that regard. It's uh, very insulative. It's good good for the, the ones that need a little bit more shelter. Okay. Yeah, I hear that it's time to feed you. Even the decks look wet. Wow. Wow. That's terrible. I'm following you, little duck. It will be very good for the newly laid garden and the potatoes. Oh, I gave them some greens yesterday. You probably remember that, maybe, if you watched that. But uh, they definitely demolished those greens. There's not much left. I have one who always lays an egg in the in the food container. I do not know why she does that. Hmm. They're so pretty. I will need to come in here and collect eggs too. Hi little ones. Oh, you're so pretty. Look at those colors. Right? A black duck, but just so many jewel tones. You're still limping, but limping less. That's good. Oh, wow. And the ducks have really been going to town in here. There must be a lot of worms in there. That's one thing I notice is that uh, there are worms everywhere here. Like I'll pick up one of these boards along the edge of the garden and there'll be hundreds of worms under it, like almost a, just a carpet. Oh no. Oh no. 
Oh no. <laughs> Hi. Are you uh, some sort of gang? <gasps> Farmyard gang? Okay, definitely time to feed. But that is definitely a cute piglet. Eating my weeds from yesterday. Okay. Y'all have a good afternoon.